The President, please be seated. Mesdames et Messieurs, veuillez vous asseoir. The court is now in session. L'audience est reprise. Before we proceed le uh, further, Avant plus loin, uh, when the floor is given to uh, the prosecutors, the chamber would like to inform the parties to the proceeding concerning the schedule for hearing the testimony of uh, the witness raised by the parties. So the Chamber would like to inform that uh, we have our actual plan to hear the witnesses starting from the second week of July. Then, uh, by then, we will have uh, the planned uh, schedule because now we have been waiting Et to select the witnesses to be heard pour le moment, nous avons here une except des témoins à witnesses KW24 because yesterday the chamber told the parties hier, and has given the opportunity to the prosecutor to give their remarks concerning the removal of witness KW24. So de after faire part de ces the à la decision is made regarding the witness, the chamber will issue the schedule, the actual schedule to the parties. And uh, we believe that it is not yet too late uh, for le issuing such a uh, schedule because during this week we are going to hear only the survivors of the S21. Les de S21. We would like now to give the floor to the parole. prosecutors to put questions to oh. Uncle Jumai. The prosecutors had advised that you have 30 minutes to put such questions. The floor is yours. De 30 minutes, reprend l'interprète, pour poser leurs questions, pour interroger le témoin. Thank you, the president, your honours. Le coprocureur cambodgien, je vous remercie. The time Madame is limited. Uh, puisque notre the temps prosecutor est compté, would like to put the question straight forward to the witness. Mr. Jumei, during the time Monsieur when Chumay, you were detained at S21, have you recognized any cadres in uh, clearly? Response. Mr. Co-Prosecutor, I have not réponse, uh, le recognized those people clearly because during the time ces -là. Car before I was uh, sent into S21, I was blindfolded. On les yeux. The next question, question said uh, the prosecutor, suivante. when you were being tortured, and interrogated. How many people interrogated you during the 12 days and nights, as you said? And uh, were the interrogators the same people or were there new faces also? Response. At that time, uh, not only Réponse. Comrade Singh interrogated me, that non seulement Comrade also Singh also interrogated me too. Ho did not uh, interrogate me, he only beat me up. Et il, euh, il fait que de me frapper. Question. When you were beaten 
physically, which part of your body were you hit? Sur quelle partie de votre corps vous a-t-on frappé? Response. Réponse. I could not defend uh, myself. Je ne pouvais I was pas put me to défendre. sit on the floor while my ankles were Alors, shackled and when I hurt uh, so much Alors, I used uh, my hands to protect me and uh, this led to the fingers broken. So, uh, the question, so you were um, beaten on the body, uh, uh, have any scars left uh, so far um, on your question. body? Portez-vous des cicatrices uh, de uh, Response, ces traitements? Uh, nothing left. Uh, no scars uh, is left except uh, non, the toes and the fingers. À l'exception de the president le, interrupts. Des uh, des uncle doigts. May, could you please be reminded again that Tumé, wait until you see the red light, otherwise your response would not be communicated uh, because interpreter would not be able to get your message across. The court official, could you please move the mic uh, away from him a little bit so that he can see the red light when it is on? de la partie civile de manière à ce qu'il puisse à de relever un petit peu le micro de, de manière à, à pouvoir faire en sorte qu'il voit la okay, so please move ahead with your questions. Bien. Question. Can I seek Poursuivre. your clarification that, that the three people saying that and who were they all present every time during the 12 days and 12 nights when you were being interrogated? Response. Sometimes uh, I saw comrade that who came to interrogate me for a few days and then uh, they took turn. Then that would come, but Ho only came to torture me with a stick. When the stick was broken, he would take another stick to beat me. A question, who took a record of your testing or confession? Did you give a sample on the confession? Response, at that time, saying had a typewriter um, on the table after réponse, interrogation, uh, uh, then they, if I did table, not respond, then they would beat me up and then they would ne type uh, pas, something. Il me frappait et ensuite il tapait, il saisissait ou il tapait uh, la so machine à écrire. There was only one person who interrogated you Question. and one Donc who uh, did the typing. Vous a interrogé et une autre s'est occupée de Response. la partie dactylographie de vos aveux. Réponse. Took two roles. I mean, he beat me. He beat me up, and after that, he typed. Ensuite, uh, la uh, so the same person performed a two tasks: beating and working on the typewriter. But the whole only came to beat me once, Mais while the other two would come regularly. Question: You said you were. Electrocuted during the 12 um, days and 12 nights of interrogation, in which day were you electrocuted? Response. I was shocked. Maybe on the eighth or ninth day. Question. Jour, en état de choc. When Question. you were led to work at the workshop Lorsque to fix the sewing machine, à do you remember whether the workshop is close to the place where one man would uh, paint si his paintings? Response. It uh, was van Nat. a bit far from Réponse. one another. One si Nat uh, worked on his paintings in the workshop, but I worked uh, outside of the fence uh, to the other part de la near the kitchen. De Question. De la Have you ever heard any Question. cries 
or screams Entendre from children or people who would have been detained cris, there. Uh, des, uh, personnes qui étaient détenues dans le complexe. At that time, I didn't think Réponse. I could hear anything à because uh, je pense que je ne we heard uh, rien entendre. children cries and we heard uh, female and male who exchanged verbal attacks uh, uh, and then it it too noisy to hear other things bruit agressif d'hommes et de Question, femmes c'était un environnement où on pouvait when you pas were entendre detained, euh, parce qu'il y avait beaucoup de bruit beaucoup de uh, the accused euh, And one night already stated that the Question. trousers or the pants that were given to you or other prisoners did not have the string no or a, a rubber string. So were you given such a, a pants with such string? Response. Que, qu uh, the pants that I was given had a elastic string. Um, but uh, elastic à la taille. before I went to S21, I made use of a, a car uh, in a tube for my uh, elastic uh, string to hold my trousers. Je me suis servi d'un système avec euh, à l'intérieur so pour you were euh, put faire tenir to mon work euh, pantalon. At Question. the workshop with one night, there were 15 people. Uh, is that correct? Atelier, um, il y avait 15 personnes. Uh, C'est exact. The president le président intervient. Interrupts. The uncle, could you please? Wait to listen to the question and la then wait a moment until the translation is finished uh, so that uh, uh, you can answer, but please respond only when the lies is on. The prosecutor, when you were gathered and put into a painting room and you said that there were 15 people. Is that correct? Response, that's correct. Exact. Réponse. Oui, exact. Question. Did you see Question, women also inside that workshop? Également dans cet atelier? Response. I did not see any women. Réponse, je n'ai vu aucune femme. Question, when you left the prison Question, for Prezar, did you notice that the women also left with you because the accused said that the il y avait des Light femmes Dara, who was the medic partie, and who was qui, the qui vous, nef, uh, niece of uh, Nguyen Chi also left uh, on the 7th of January 1979 uh, while the Vietnamese troops uh, were, uh, were approaching. So did she go with you to Prezor at that time? Vous, elle est allée avec vous après ça. Response. Réponse. I did not see any women going femme. with me. While we left to Slang, we stopped at the corner uh, in intersection. I did not see any women. And then when we reached Wat San Sam Kosal, and for the whole night we spent there, I did not see any women. And then we moved further until we reached Prezar and uh, I did not see any women there. And uh, at dawn, we left Prezar until we got to Ang Snul, the watermelon plantation that I saw a few women and I saw my wife. Alors, là, il y avait un champ de pastèque où j'ai vu ma femme. The co-prosecutor, thank you, Mr. Chumai. I, for answering my questions, I would like uh, to uh, give this opportunity to my colleague to put further questions. Uh, the president, the co-prosecutor, the floor is yours. Le président, Monsieur co-procureur international, je vous donne la parole. Mr. Council and uh, Mr. Chumai, good afternoon. Mr. Chumai, 
Bonjour. Quelques questions à vous poser sur le sens de votre témoignage de ce matin. Quand vous avez quitté la première Phnom question Penh est la suivante. Vous avez quitté Phnom Penh um, le 17 avril 1975. Vous avez dit que euh, votre, euh, vous avez été forcé de quitter Phnom Penh par les Khmer Rouges. Est-ce exact Réponse. That is correct. C'est exact. And on the way out of Phnom Penh, you said the roads were full, people leaving Phnom Penh. À la sortie de Phnom Penh, en sortant de Phnom Penh, vous avez dit que les trois personnes étaient tuées. Il y avait beaucoup de monde sur la route. Vous avez dit que trois personnes ont été abattues. Qui étaient ces personnes S'agissait-il de soldats, de civils Vous pouvez vous dire, vous pouvez dire qui les a abattus. Il s'agissait du moment où vous êtes sorti de Phnom Penh. Response. I probably cannot catch your question. Could you please repeat? Because I did not say that three people were shot. I don't remember saying that this morning. I apologize. I may have misheard you. In any event, on the way out of Phnom Penh, you said there were a number of dead bodies. Can you tell the court whether those dead bodies appeared to be soldiers or civilians? Response. I did not. Inspect the dead bodies seriously, but I saw the swollen bodies and I stepped on them. And when I fetched the water and after cooking my meal at about 4 a.m., we were forced out and moved further on National Road Number Five. And along the road, we could see the fish ponds, and we saw the dead body lying along the road and. In those ponds, and we saw fish feeding on those corpses, and we just proceeded further. Thank you. From your experience from leaving Phnom Penh, are you able to say what happened to people that decided that they didn't want to go? From your observations, are you able to say? Pouvez-vous êtes-vous arrivé à conclure ce qui arrivait, ce qui pouvait arriver aux personnes qui refusaient de partir de Phnom Penh? Réponse. I think I talked already about the situation at Sa De Po. When the Khmer Rouge came, we put up a white cloth to cheer them up, along with the other people. And later in the afternoon, about 5 p.m. or 6 p.m., then the Khmer Rouge told us that we had to leave Phnom Penh, five kilometers far from Phnom Penh, to avoid being bombarded by the Americans. So we first did not want to leave, but then they forced us and opened fire. And a few people collapsed. That's why I could not stand any longer. But I came home and brought with me the family to leave. And I'm sorry to raise this again, but you said that after you were evacuated or forced out of Phnom Penh, that your two-year-old son died. Can you tell the court whether your son was sick before he left Phnom Penh? Or was it the through the process of being evacuated that he became ill and died? Is it the process of being evacuated or was he ill before? Is it the process of being evacuated or was he ill before? Response. Response. My child died in March 1975. Had not been sick before. Auparavant, mon fils n'était pas malade. Spent some time. 
uh, at the location where I saw nous the corpse, uh, he was uh, nous, falling nous ill, and then we crossed uh, 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 the river to the other side of the river, river and then it rained. And my child developed a diarrhea and fever, and uh, I asked uh, for some medicines from Anka, but I would be referred to another person uh, who would be the Anka, but I could never find the Anka to get the medicine, and later on, uh, the sickness was severe until he died, and I buried him before we could uh, travel uh, move further. Uh, aller plus loin. Thank you. Question. Perhaps now Merci. if we could move um, to S21 when you were there from the 28th of October to early January um, 1979. You've testified today that you didn't see the accused, Doik, at S21. Uh, you've also testified that you didn't see him torture. Uh, While you were at S21, did you hear of his name? And the reason why I ask you that is that in your statement to the co-prosecutors at D2-0014-6779, that's the English ERN, it will supply the Khmer um, shortly, you stated, I only heard from others that Doik was the big chief there. My, my question is, did you hear from others that Doik was the big chief whilst you were at S21 back in 1978 and early 1979, or did you only hear that afterwards? Response. Regarding the person named Deutsch, I never saw him. Even I would have seen him, I would not recognize him. I only uh, heard uh, that he was the big chief of those line because grandfather D. Pon, who were detained uh, next to me, told me about Deutsch, and I, I never looked into his face anyway if I uh, even had seen him. Thank you, and that was told to you whilst you were in the large cell, is that correct? Response that that is correct. C'est exact. I just have a couple of questions about the large cell in which you were detained, and I would ask that uh, uh, Mr. President, we show on the screen D69. It's a video clip. D69. V zero zero one seven two five two five and it's at the forty two second mark. It's a picture what we believe to be the large cell. And I'd ask that the um, the witness be able to comment on that. Uh, où étaient détenus les prisonniers, si je peux vous demander de Just as a matter of clarification, um, uh, Mr. Smith, is this a video that is part of the material provided by the expert appointed by the court? I can't remember his name. It starts with Z. Uh, Mr. Zoran Lessig. Yes. Uh, no, it's not. It's a separate, uh, separate video material that was provided uh, uh, placed on the case file. Um, last year. But it's not the material that's still under the consideration, consideration, the Vietnamese film. No, you are not. It's quite Thank you. 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 Thank Um, projeter sur nos écrans ce document. Please, if you can. 
si c'est possible. Document, uh, Il s'agit du document D69-0017-25-25. Mr. Chumay, do you see a, a photograph on your screen? It's a photograph that we believe to be a photograph of a large cell at S21. Can you look at that photograph and comment on whether or not that was similar to the situation that you were in when you were placed in a large cell in the evening for those two months in 1978? Respond. Réponse. I think uh, looking at the people who were lying down on the Je floors, it would have been in the large personnes common personnes room, but uh, qui sont uh, having seen sol, him sitting up like this, I don't know whether it is taken from that Mais cell because uh, people would be uh, would not be allowed to sit up. Photo. Alors qu'elle était assise, je ne sais pas parce Thank que on ne pas aux personnes just à show a brief video clip which comes from this video, uh, Your Honor. It's uh, from 43 seconds to 59 seconds, and this is what is believed to be a reconstruction of what a large cell looked like back in 1978. Can you look at this film clip and tell the court whether or not that's a familiar sight to you, bearing in mind where you stayed in the large cell? Your collective puis je demandais à la chambre de bien vouloir passer cet extrait vidéo the president uh, could you please verify the reference number to this uh, video clip for example the er number or b number like that Thank you, Your Honour. It's the same video, D69, V0017-2525, and it's from 43 seconds to 59 seconds, and it's a documentary produced by Bill Brummel in relation to S21. If the AV... President, the audio and visual officers, could you arrange to have the uh, video clip display? vouloir afficher à nos écrans, sur nos écrans, cette séquence vidéo. Mr. Chumay, that video clip Monsieur that was on your, on your screen was not a video clip from 1978, but a reconstruction as to uh, what uh, witnesses had said that large room was like. We would like your comment on uh, the accuracy of that video clip as to whether it accords with your experience being placed in that large room for those two months. Mr. Co-Prosecutor, that video clip which I just saw is exactly the same to the condition that I was in at the time. However, the previous uh, photo of a person sitting was not Usual because usually if everybody lied down, all had to lie down. Si if you wanted to sit up, up you had to ask for permission. Pour il and perhaps one question about that large question. room. 
You testified today that uh, often um, people were taken out of that large cell and never returned. Can you tell the court how often people were taken out of that room? Was it or how often? People were taken out previously they were taken out from a different long bar and uh, one incident three people from the same long bar were taken from my role. And when they were taken out, did the guard come into the room or were they called out from the door? Est-ce que l'on faisait sortir les prisonniers en les appelant depuis la porte? Réponse. People would come and unlock the long bar. Les gardes d'entrée déverrouillaient les our hands would be cuffed to the back before the long bar would be removed. So they first cut our hands to the back. And one last question. If you can look at E53 Annex 4-46, it's a photograph taken by the expert, Mr. Zoran and Mr. Chumay, it's a photograph of you in a small cell um, at a reconstruction last year. I just have one brief question about that, if that can be shown on the screen, Your Honor. Yes, Your Honor, I have a question about the photo. Mr. President, the AV unit can you display the file E53.4 on the screen? Mr. Chumay, you stated that for the 12 days that you were interrogated and tortured, that you were placed in this cell for that period of time. What was the, the feeling? What was the feeling you had when you were placed in this cell day in and day out after being tortured jour après jour. for 12 days. Pendant 12 jours et alors que vous étiez torturé. Mr. Co-Prosecutor, when I entered that room and cell, Quand je suis entré dans cette I cellule, could not expect that I would survive. Je ne m'attendais pas à survivre. At that time, I only lied down on my back, waiting just to be killed. M'allonger sur le dos en attendant d'être tué. It was the first time that I lied down directly on the floor. First time in my life. La première fois de ma vie. And it was the first time in my life that I was hosed with water when I was detained there. Arrosé d'eau. Even if you raise a pig, you had to give food to the pig. But for me, I only got a spoonful of very thin gruel. And I was released from jail. Uncle May, please recompose yourself. Monsieur Chu May, prenez le temps de vous. Uh... 
this is the time de vous remettre. We are conducting our trial. Next, I would like to give the floor to the civil party lawyers in group one. Next, I would like to give the floor to the civil party lawyers in group one. Next, I would like to give the floor to the civil party lawyers in group one. Next, I would like to give the floor to the civil party lawyers in group one. Next, I would like to give the floor to the civil party lawyers in group one. Next, I would like to give the floor to the civil party lawyers in group one. Thank you, Mr. President. Um, I would like to uh, inform uh, the Chamber on behalf of all civil party, party groups uh, that we suggest and uh, we hope uh, uh, that the Chamber will accept uh, that uh, those lawyers who represent uh, the civil parties have priority and questioning and get the uh, uh, most of the time and the other groups will only uh, ask additional questions and I think this is a reasonable proposal and uh, all civil party uh, lawyers group agree upon this proposal and that would mean uh, concerning uh, Mr. Chumay that mainly um, Mr. Hong Kim Sun who was uh, his lawyer from the big starting point and uh, I myself as international lawyer um, from the beginning would like to uh, begin to today and then the other lawyers would uh, ask additional questions and I hope uh, the chamber will of course not exceeding the 40 minutes uh, that are, um, uh, are provided for questioning. I hope the chamber will agree upon this. Thank you. Uh, President, you can proceed with that arrangement, and I hope the lawyers for Group 1 and Group 3 do not object in this approach. We do, we do not, Your Honor, and uh, the position is exactly as stated by Mr. Dinsky. The President, the President, Ms. Stutzinski or Mr. Hong Kong Soon, you can now take the floor to ask questions to Uncle Chumay. The floor is yours, Hong Kong Soon. Thank you, Mr. President. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Your Honours, Madame, Monsieur le Juge. Good afternoon, Uncle Chumay. Bon après-midi, Monsieur Chumay. I am a Chumay. lawyer, of course, your lawyer, and I would like to ask the questions. Je suis votre avocat. J'aimerais vous poser quelques questions. From the day you received a summons to appear in this chamber, vous avez reçu une citation what pour was your feeling? Ici à la chambre, quel était votre sentiment ce jour-là? Réponse. Mr. Lawyer, my feeling after I received the summons to appear before this chamber devant la chambre de première instance was so exciting, so happy. C'est un sentiment de bonheur. I was so clear in my mind that that I would. Il était très clair pour moi que je pourrais témoigner pour jeter la lumière sur les événements à l'intention de la Chambre et pour dire la vérité. Et ça a été un grand soulagement. Si je n'avais pas pu venir devant la Chambre pour témoigner devant vous et devant les avocats, Bordering, and I wanted to get it out of my chest. Je voulais me soulager de ce que j'ai à dire. Thank you, says Mr. Hong Kong Soon. Merci, Mr. Hong Kong Soon. So it means you want to show to show the suffering physically and emotionally to this chamber. Physique et morale endurée. And I would like to ask the question. 
You already stated to the chamber regarding the torture inflicted upon you at S21, or commonly known as a tool slime prison, regarding the toll pulling. And you also informed the number of the people who tortured and interrogated you. Can you recall the name of the person who pulled your toes? Toenails? You may, Mr. Lawyer. The, the first person who tortured me was Seng. After he fed up with beating me up, then Comrade Ho. He had a scar near his eye, and later on saying, told Ho that I did not confess, and so Comrade Ho rolled up his sleeves, got a stick, and beat me up. After that stick was broken, he used another stick to beat me up, and he scolded me, you motherfucker, how come you still hide the information? After he scolded me, then he left. My question is, says Hong Kong Soon, what was the name amongst the three people that is Comrade Tet, Comrade Ho, and Comrade Seng was the one who used a plier to squeeze and pull out your toenails. Jumai, Mr. Lawyer, the person who pulled my toenails was Comrade Seng. And Comrade Tan did not uh, pull Tan my toenails. He only beat me up. Thank you, says Hong Kong Soon. Comrade Seng was Merci the person who Soon. pulled my toenails, and he also sat on my head ongles, and threatened me. You confess or not? Dit, à vous, à vous pas. Thank you, says Hong Kong Soon. Merci my next Kim question. When your toenails, both toenails were pulled out, was there a lot of blood? How painful was it? And how long did the pain last? Mr. Lawyer, the Toenails pulling was done one each day for two days. On m'a arraché les ongles so un an pendant deux jours. So it was painful. I could not Et walk straight. Ça faisait mal. I could Je walk little by little in smaller steps. Des tout petits pas. And in my mind, I knew physically Et I was. It was so painful, but. La douleur physique est très, très Emotionally, I was so painful as well. Mais surtout très Thank you, say Sankamsoon. Moralement. So after the nails Merci were pulled out, Sun, it was wounded. Les ongles, when the wounds blessé, recovered, uh, in a, a month's time, in two months' time, after the cicatrization, a month, two months, it took more than one month before mois. it's recovered and I could walk Avant properly. Que je ne me et que je Thank you, says Hongkong Soon. You already stated to the chamber regarding regarding the allegation made by the interrogators at S21 that you were a CIA agent, and of course it was not true. So how did you feel? Because you were not, and that you were wrongly accused. What was your feeling? On this matter, I could never forget the suffering that I Je received at S21 until the day that I died. 
and once a, the justice can be done by the, your honors, then I, I would feel better. Que quand sera Thank par you. Que je me Say mieux. from come soon. And Maître Hawkinson. after Merci. you were free and left S S21 uh, until today, libre un jour, when uh, you heard the S21, name Dulslang Prison in your mind, le nom de la how do you feel? Slang uh, que to my uh, Mr. Lawyer, on this matter, it has been more than three months. Cela fait plus de Whenever the word Tools like prison comes to my mind, I could not hold my tears. It drops automatically every single day when I have heard about S21, about tools like, about torture, then my tears torture, just keep flowing. Je ne peux que pleurer. And in my mind, I do not know what's going to happen to me in the future, as I could not control my tears when I have heard such words. Je ne peux pas ces so then entendre. I asked the PBO, the Psychological Organization, de and I was told that because TPDO, of the anger et euh, l'on m'a expliqué que c'est la the trauma I suffered during the Khmer Rouge regime that I need to, régime Khmer Rouge, to keep my mind free from those feelings. Je dois essayer However, de ne pas how hard I tried, my tears quoi still que je fasse, drop. Quoi que j'essaye, je ne peux retenir mes larmes. Mr. Hong Kumsun. Uh, uncle, Maître please uh, recompose yourself in order to answer my questions. I do not have much time Je left. Pas beaucoup de temps pour vous poser des It's questions. still also regarding your emotion. Je voudrais poursuivre so, and right euh, now, do you have freedom? Do you have the right to vous move around and libre. to vous speak freely? And when you make frequent trips to tools like vous vous how do you feel you feel you have the Alors, freedom that you have now or when you were there you feel that you were still in that era that period of Quand time vous êtes à Twelsling, vous vous sentez de nouveau transporté à cette époque Jumai, on this Réponse. very matter that i have tried my best for fait de mon mieux. about 30 years in order to seek assistance from the human rights organizations to find justice for me. At that time, I had no right at all. I could not speak. I could not hear. I could not see anything. I was not allowed to see or hear or say anything during that three years, eight months, 20 days period. It was the most suffering period in my entire life. I had no right, no freedom, and I had nobody that I could express the suffering to. Thank you, Sir Sankomsoon. I have another question before I Merci. hand the floor to the question. international Alors lawyer. De, de la à when la the consoeur, people who tortured you and then you were sent back to the individual cell, puis renvoyé, uh, dans votre you, you had a very suffering, you wept, you cried. Did you have the right to vous cry so that other people could hear the cry? Pleuriez. Est-ce que on vous laissait pleurer dans votre cellule you may, Mr. Lawyer, que les autres éventuellement At that time, not even réponse. weeping, even just whispering, we were not allowed. We Chuchoté were not allowed to make interdit. any noise. On pas le droit de when faire I le went, I could not Et make any noise. Quand je, dans ma cellule, I je wept a lot and I had no more tears to, to weep. Donc, I was only waiting for the day that I would be killed at that time. Simplement le jour où Thank you, say some come soon. Mr. President, I would like now to give the floor to my international lawyer. Consoeur, la the international lawyer, le the floor is yours, Mr. President. Je vous en prie. Yeah, thank you, Mr. President. Good afternoon, Mr. Chumay. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Bon après-midi, Monsieur Chumay. Um, I have only a few questions. Um, Je voudrais poser um, quelques questions. 
and would like to start with the cell that we have seen from the reenactment. A commencer par la cellule. And could you describe a little bit more how were the circumstances when you were in this cell? For example, was it dark? Had you light? How was the exact size of this cell? Could you elaborate a little bit on this? Thank you. Thank you. Miss Lawyer, réponse. in that individual cell, when I entered, there was Quand je suis a cartridge, dans cette cellule, il y avait une and a plastic container. Et un, un the cartridge case was for the feces, and the plastic container was for the urine. And when they were full, I sued. Tell the guard. Quand, uh, the room was about two meters time one meter wide. La cellule faisait à peu près deux mètres sur un. Um, was there a guard in front of your cell, in front of the Question. door, outside? Il un garde posté if la you de la wanted, for example, something to drink, or that they come to uh, si vous take the soif, boxes or the ammunition box with them? Il fallait emporter les récipients contenant les excréments ou l'urine. But Miss Lawyer, Réponse. we were guarded constantly. Nous en when we were thirsty, we asked for soif, water. Whatever was given, we just took it. We did not dare to uh, ask for more. Nous if nous we were given a, plus. a half full of a glass, si we just un took un it. Or if we were given a, a full glass, we just took Et it. Si on nous donnait un verre plein, nous le prenions. Was there was your impression that Question. there was a guard uh, outside of the cell, or un garde did you poste à de la have to shout very loud? Was it fallait crier très fort pour uh, attirer l'attention d'un garde? Chumai, réponse. Miss Lawyer. When I was thirsty, I would ask, Quand Brother, soif, je I want some water. I am thirsty. So the guard would fetch a glass of water and walk to the cell and gave it to me. Cellule, me After that, I drank. Even if uh, I could get rid of my thirst or not, I je would not ask for more. Et même si j'avais encore soif ou pas, euh, je ne demandais pas plus d'eau. Was the cell Question. Uh, dark Parce qu'il faisait sombre the whole time, or did you have light in the cell? Est-ce qu'il y avait uh, de la lumière? Jumai. Réponse. Miss Lawyer, that cell was constantly dark. La there was no light because, because all the windows to that room were all closed. So obturé. both day and night it was all dark. It was all the same. De nuit, il faisait sombre. Could you have Question. from nowadays on if you look back could you have your or an, any orientation about how long you were in this cell, or um, how uh, yes, how long you were in the cell? Any time orientation? Est-ce que vous pouvez nous, nous donner une estimation du temps que vous passiez dans la cellule? Jumai. Réponse. I was in that individual cell. For only 12 days and 12 nights. Nice. After that, I was placed quoi, in the common room upstairs until Phnom Penh fell. Après quoi, on m'a transféré dans la grande cellule à l'étage supérieur où je suis resté jusqu'à la chute de Phnom Penh. Question. 
to the interrogators. Je voudrais maintenant vous poser une question concernant les interrogateurs. Vous them and vous said avez they donné leur nom et vous avez uh, dit que like tous par pause. Was always only one person in si the interrogation uh, cell, pour chaque séance interrogatoire, or more than one present un interrogateur during ou plus un the interrogation during the interrogation. During the séance. Tu réponse. Miss Lawyer, there was only one Il interrogator. Un interrogateur. For example, Kamrat Singh, Par exemple, Singh, he interrogated Singh, as well as he typed on the typewriter. Et il tapait aussi à la machine. In the moment when Hor came in Question. to beat you up, as you have, have told us, was he alone in the room or was another interrogator in the room? Was he alone in the room or was another interrogator in the room? Ou y avait-il encore un autre interrogateur Tu m'as, Miss Lawyer. Réponse. At that time, I was with Kamrat Say, who interrogated me. Dans la when pièce, en train de m'interroger. When Kamrat Say entered. Then Kamrat Singh reported to him that I arrivé, did not confess. So after he heard that, Kamrat Ho rolled up his sleeves. Or, uh, a he pulled a stick and uh, bit me up. One stick was broken. Then he used another stick. And there were actually a bunch, quite a large bunch of sticks next to the table. À côté de la table. Thank you. That was like uh, I could call it uh, like Question. a control through her, and then to intervene that you should confess and to beat you up. And I take it like this that her controlled if saying already get a complete confession from you. S'assurer que Seng avait obtenu de vous les aveux qu'il souhaitait. Miss Lawyer, I cannot understand the question clearly. Can you repeat? Maître, pouvez-vous répéter? Thank you. Yes. Am I right that you said that Hor entered the room and that he controlled if you have already given a complete confession and to intervene then? Et pour intervenir. Response. Réponse. I find it difficult to respond because I do not know whether Hall came to control the confession or not. But at that time, only after hearing what Singh told him, Hall immediately grabbed a stick and beat me right in front of Singh. And Hall was a well-built person. And later on, he explained to me and asked me to recognize him as the person named Hall. He told me later on, I would be easy to be recognized with the scars on my face, so please remember it. Il m'a dit ultérieurement que ce sera facile de se rappeler de moi parce que j'ai une cicatrice au visage. Question. Est-ce que c'est la seule fois que Or est entré dans la salle d'interrogatoire pendant cette période où vous avez été interrogé nuit et jour Réponse. Oui, c'est la seule fois où il est entré dans la pièce. My next one.
second. My next question um, concerns the time when you have already left the individual cell and when you started your work in the workshop. And I would like to know if from this moment when you started individual, the work until the end when you could leave Tulsling, if you have been threatened, je veux savoir si vous avez été beaten menacé, or battu, insulted by guards ou insulté par les gardes ou par d'autres membres du personnel de S21. <coughs> Response. Réponse. During the time when I was working, I was no longer mistreated. Uh, Je pas été during the day, they would uh, let Pendant me work journée, in the workshop outside uh, uh, to the other uh, fence, and at night they would uh, take me back and. and uh, put the caps mm, and shackles on me, on me uh, and uh, later on, of course, I was threatened mm, to be travail. shot. Uh, Et, uh, plus, uh, tard. Uh, Thank you, Mr. Chumay. Uh, um, I have a last <coughs> question, and this is, uh, I would like um, to know Une dernière question à vous poser, Monsieur Chumay. which question would you like to ask the accused? Would you please tell the chamber what is your nous dire painful question? Quelle est cette question douloureuse que vous aimeriez poser? Responses. The question that I would la seek the permission from the president to ask Deutsch would be about the CIA and la CIA its organization. So I only have two questions Je to ask deux questions him. À the president. Oh, so what questions are you going to ask to the accused? Allez-vous poser à Duke? Mr. Chum, my, my question la is réponse, when I was accused of being CIA, de faire de have la CIA, uh, all the CIA agents been uh, smashed or, or all or are there still any CIA agents uh, remain? Number two, vivant. Ça, la première question. when you mentioned Deuxième about Anka, what kind of Anka was it? Because when I went to Tours Lang, I was asked by uh, students about Anka, and I could not answer to them. And they asked Anka, me who Pol Pot was, and I could not uh, respond to those young students because I myself cannot say that Pol Pot and Khmer Rouge would be the same, so I am ambivalent when it comes Pol Pot to Khmer Rouge who is who here. Qu Donc je ne sais pas trop so qui the president, the president uh, would you want to ask him three questions or two, uh, deux deux especially when it comes to the last one about who would be Paul Pot? Pour ce qui est de la dernière. Uh, de Pol Pot. Mr. Chumay, actually, the last question was about uh, the réponse, question the students asked me, and then I could not find the answer. That's why I would probably posé. refer it to Doug. Et je n'ai pas pu la répondre. C'est pour ça que j'aimerais la poser à Doug lui-même. The president, uh, the accused. Have you listened to Monsieur these questions? Avez -vous and the first question is that he was accused la question of being CIA agent. And le, he went on to say that have all the CIA CIA agents already demandé uh, si tous been les agents de la CIA avaient déjà turned up? Été écrasé. The accused. accusé. Mr. President and Monsieur Brother President, May, Monsieur May, 
I would like to clarify that the term CIA, I think you have been observing the proceedings long ago, and that the CIA is the term used to uh, refer to people who were opposing them. So CIA here were not people who uh, received a salary uh, or organized by the Americans. It was meant to refer to those who opposed the CPK and that we still have some of them. And those who opposed the CPK still remain. That's why they uh, won or have beaten the CPK. So uh, the real CIA and the CIA pursued by the CPK are different. So CPK, for example, implicated you as CIA. They only identified you who were opposing uh, the, uh, them. That's why you were presumed as being the CIA agent. Uh, so the opponents of the CPK have beaten the CPK, so I don't think uh, they have been gotten rid of anyway. The president, the second question from Mr. Jumai is seeking your explanation about the term encain. What would it mean? Quelle est la signification de ce terme encain? Thank you, Mr. President, say the accused. I would like to tell Brother Jumai that Anka referred to the standing committee. Among them, they even called Pol Pot as Anka. And, for example, like me, I worked at S21, I called Son Sen Anka because Son Sen represented uh, the standing committee, Sonsen that's all. Comme étant Lankar, parce que Sonsen était le représentant du the comité president, uh, permanent. Voilà. Is there any further questions Trois, the lawyer uh, would like to put le, to le the witness, uh, Ms. Studzinski? Maître Studzinski, souhaitez-vous poser d'autres uh, questions? Sorry, thank you, Mr. Ah, President. Monsieur Chumay, Maître Studzinski. Our core group, let's say, uh, in this case, there are no uh, further questions. I would uh, give the floor to my colleagues. Thank you very much. Pas d'autres questions posées. Je vais donner la parole à ma consoeur ou à mes confrères et consoeurs. Bonjour, Monsieur le Président. Bonjour, Mesdames et Messieurs les juges. Bonjour, Monsieur Choumet. Je voudrais vous poser les questions suivantes qui sont relatives à votre période d'incarcération à S21. Premièrement, est-ce que lorsque vous étiez détenu à S21, vous avez eu l'impression que les gardiens, les interrogateurs, ou les autres personnes qui travaillaient à S21 avaient peur ou étaient terrorisées. Réponse. Réponse. At S21, for the period of ah, about four months, I never looked at them in the face. I just uh, looked into the ground when I walked past them. And during the times when I was there, I was blindfolded and shackled. And when I was walking upstairs, then they would uh, pull my ears up and oreilles. down, and uh, I was so scared that I could not uh, look at Et them into the face. Peur que je ne pouvais les regarder droit dans les yeux. Question. Est-ce que lorsque Question. vous avez été détenu à S21, vous avez entendu les gardiens ou les interrogateurs rire ou s'amuser entre eux est-ce qu'il n'y avait qu'une ambiance de terreur Response. Réponse. At uh, that time, when I were worked behind the 
uh, location actually je I heard uh, when people laughed when people rire, cried and I pleurer, don't know whether they laughed uh, si uh, for riaient, uh, I mean, they had fans having tortured si prisoners or not. Uh, and as Deutsch already mentioned, he Duke did not hear dit, anything. And I don't believe his uh, testimony because even I worked far behind uh, the, si je, uh, the premises. I could even hear the screams, the cries. And loin, je même when people de cris. stopped uh, to break uh, and then there would be less uh, noisy then later on we would hear some pause, further noises il y avait un petit peu moins de bruit et on pouvait par conséquent mieux entendre ce qui se passait merci question thank you lorsque vous avez été détenu dans la cellule dans la grande cellule où vous étiez de nombreux détenus est-ce que vous avez vu des détenus revenir après avoir été interrogés ou avoir été torturés. could be seen coming back. On pouvait en voir certains Some revenir. Had disappeared. D'autres avaient disparu. Question. question. Est-ce que quand vous-même vous avez when été détenu dans cette grande cellule après avoir été torturé, vous avez expliqué, même discrètement, à vos voisins ce qui vous est arrivé sur la cellule individuelle, sur les interrogatoires et les tortures. Did you explain to them how you had been in the individual cell? Had you, did you explain to them, even in whispers, how you were tortured? Response. Réponse. I did not uh, talk to my neighbors. Je ne parlais pas aux personnes qui étaient à côté de moi. No explained anything. One day I Je heard uh, the noise of a truck at about 11 un bruit de p pm and I asked uh, my neighbor why the truck came but in whisper but uh, we did not let uh, the guards who were guarding outside uh, know our les gars uh, qui étaient à proximité and, uh, et entendre the guy told nos me that the truck would come to collect uh, prisoners to be taken away to le camion be smashed là pour emmener des prisonniers at à l'exécution au champ d'exécution de Chang'ek. I had to wait until j'ai dû uh, the moment that passed 12 p.m. at night that I could sleep because otherwise I would be uh, taken on the track to be smashed. Uh, so another day. Que, uh, si à cette heure -là, ça veut dire que je n'étais pas emmené pour être écrasé. Question. Est-ce qu'il y avait Question. une certaine solidarité, une aide, une coopération entre les détenus Réponse. Personne ne pouvait aider qui que ce soit or her own because uh, how could seul. we uh, help one another because Comment we were shackles autres, and anything entravés. could be done upon permission from the guards quoi. even when we moved yeah. and then made uh, some Même noise bouger, uh, then we would be bruit, beaten uh, if we did not uh, let the guards nous, know nous uh, about uh, our uh, movement. Si on ne prévenait pas, si on ne demandait pas l'autorisation des gardes pour pouvoir bouger, nous étions battus. Question. 
Est-ce qu'il y avait toujours un garde réveillé avec vous dans la cellule Response. Réponse. Gat uh, would be walking guard. back and forth uh, mm. on the corridor, and then uh, we would uh, shout to them to bring some water when we were thirsty, and w when uh, we would, would like uh, to, to sit up, then we would also ask them for permission pour to do nous so. Lui demandions également la Permission. Enfin, dernière question. Est-ce que vous avez eu conscience que vous étiez tous des victimes ou est-ce que même vous, vous avez craint que ceux qui soient détenus à côté de vous étaient peut-être des traîtres that some of the people, perhaps, who were detained and shackled next to you, possibly were traitors Response. Réponse. I think everyone who would be shackled uh, there would have been pursued as traitors already. So, se trouvait dans cette as salle entravée, already hein, mentioned, everyone who entered Tuol's line would never be released, and it is obvious it's true. Y entrait pour ne jamais en sortir, et ce qui a été dit ici est vrai. Ainsi, en fait. Vous-même, so, détenu à tout cela, vous n'avez jamais pu avoir la moindre euh, confiance dans les autres never, détenus à vos côtés. You were never in a position to be able to trust the other detainees shackled next to you. You were never in a position to have any amount of trust in your co-detainees. Response. Réponse. How could we trust them? Of course, uh, I could whisper into the ear of my neighbor about the truck once, but uh, I never been able to ask them why they were arrested or because uh, the guard would be very vigilant and um, we could be hurt and we could be in trouble. emmenés et les gardes étaient très vigilants. Il fallait donc faire très attention. Merci, Monsieur Choumé. Thank you, Mr. Choumé. Now the time allocated for civil party lawyers have already been used and the chamber would like to take 20 minutes adjournment. We will resume at 10 past 3 p.m. The court official, could you please uh, take Uncle Chumay to uh, have a rest uh, before he could be returned to the courtroom? Monsieur Chumay, de manière à lui permettre de uh, se relaxer pendant quelques minutes avant de reprendre les débats.